Hi there and welcome. This is Nellie Deutsch and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to embed Wakelet and Padlet into your Moodle course in the uh, message area. This is for teachers and students. You don't need to turn editing on or anything like that. This is what it'll look like. Notice if I hit the link, I don't have to go there. I can simply view everything here. And um, and that's it. Okay, I don't even have to log in. Very important for some students. And if I go into the Padlet link, notice I get everything here and I don't have to go anywhere. I can just view it within the course. Now, how is this done? Let me show you. I'm going to go into reply as I reply to this. And notice under reply, I will have to go into advanced. And then I go into insert and generico and I simply add the website. Okay, let me add Padlet. We'll change the order here. Padlet wall, and you can give it a title, and then the link, so I'll go into Padlet. Here it is. Get the link, and you have to make sure that the link is viewable by anyone who has the link, which means that they can view it. They don't have to edit, but they can view it, and then I'm going to just paste the link right there. Okay, and then it'll look kind of funny. Let me go into Wakelet. Uh, I'm going to go into Insert and then Generico Widgets. Go into Website. Now on Wakelet, it's a little bit tricky because you can't share your collections. It will not work because these are not viewable by anyone who has the link. They're only viewable by you. But if you go into one of these, okay, these spaces that you've created, notice these spaces. And uh, these are in the collections. I simply click on it and then I'm able, I'll be able, well, the students will be able to see this. Let me go into another one. Okay, so if I go back into spaces, teaching EFL, for example, if I go into any of these, for example, this one has 25 items. That looks exciting. If I go into that, and I want to see these board games. I go into share and then uh, notice anyone with the link, it's already been done even though it's not my work, can view. I simply copy the link and then I go back into the course and here it's Wakelet and it's, uh, I can even write the name which is board games. Okay, and then uh, simply paste the link that you saw and then it looks kind of funny. Don't worry about that. It's okay. And then I'm going to go into the post to form so I can show you what it looks like. Let me go into it. And there we've got the two links. If it's the Padlet. Now, by the way, they're also able to add. If they're in their um, Padlet account, and they're allowed to add, not just view, but also to add, they'll be able to add straight from here. They won't have to go into Padlet. They could do it straight from the message area. And we want to keep our students in our courses. We don't want them to go off and, and maybe find it hard to come back. So either we embed or we do it like this with Generico. Or let's go into the Wakelet. Notice here it is. But in this case, um, notice um, that part of a course you need to log in to be able to add anything but at least you can view it and that's the idea to be able to view things and that's generico if you're interested let me know and i'll give you more information on how to get generico for your moodle if you're the admin you need to install generico if you're a teacher ask your admin for this thank you for watching and enjoy teaching online.